Hello and welcome to the channel. My name is Corey. I'm the old man that is bad at games and this is day two of what we now think is COVID and our video game extravaganza. So let's hop back in to Judgment. Kaito, what's up? Hey man, where are you? Just left a club called Amour over on Supon Street. Amour? Isn't that one of the Matsugane joints? Yep. Hamura and the victim were apparently alone in here the night of the murder. Anyway, need something? Yep. Swing by the office when you're done there. What's up? Uh, it's no rush. You'll see when you get here. Later. Alright. So there may be less commentary, which I'm sure you won't care about. Uh, just due to random cold stuff. But let's, uh, let's explore Comparocho some more and see what we can come up with. I feel like he should probably change his clothes at some point wearing them for three days now I think or else he's like Ernest P. Worrell and just has a bunch of the same outfits I don't know only time will tell what the huh? why is she here how about you ask her yourself Romeo good to see you Yakami-kun Don't worry, it's not what you think. Where my cats go? Before you ask, she's not here to win your heart again. Win my heart again? Hold on a minute. Let's make one thing clear. We never dated. Guess I misspoke. Don't sue. Yeah. <clears throat> I'm here on business. That should be obvious. Business? The prosecutor's office is pressing murder charges against Kyohei Hamra of the Matsugane family. You're involved, aren't you, Yagami-kun? Word travels fast. Nothing that happens in Genda's office gets away from me. Saori-san just can't keep a secret, huh? Not with me. We go way back. Since you were kids, right? Yep. Back to Hamra, though. They're already pressing charges? They only just arrested Sorry. Him. Apparently the prosecutors had his eye on Hamra for a while now. He's just been lying in wait for the perfect Trying to win the grossest uh, video awards is... with the series. Your friend Izumira. Somehow I knew it'd be him. You haven't seen that guy since the whole not guilty verdict, huh, Talk? Yep. He's probably still sore about it. Too bad Shintani's gonna be the one in charge of the case and not me. You're really never becoming a lawyer again, are you? I don't want to talk about it anymore. Genda Sensei asked me the same question. I see. Does the prosecution have any work for me? I'd be glad to cut you a discount. You know what, Yagami-kun? Hmm? This detective business really doesn't suit you. Oh, snap. Couldn't she have just called? Think she went through the trouble for a reason? Maybe you? It's uh, getting dark out. I should walk her back. Huh. Check her bag for the cats. I don't know where my cats went. Look there. Where'd she go? For you. Not so fast. Who are you? Chief Prosecutor? And Yagami Kun, what are you doing? Well, I was planning to walk you home. Really? That's so sweet. 
Well then, I apologize for my forcefulness. Sure. This is Chief Prosecutor Morita. And, um, you already know Prosecutor Izumita. Long time no see, Yagami Sensei. Courtroom just hasn't been the same without you around. Damn near breaks my heart. So you're defending Hamura, huh? Nope, Shintani's handling it. I'm just collecting evidence. Looks like you don't need that walk home, Mafu you. Later. Oh yeah, I almost forgot. You're not a lawyer anymore. Even after your landmark acquittal. Too bad. I only won because I was up against you. Oh, joke. Enough. If it wasn't for your bullshit logic, Language. that murderer would have been behind bars. An innocent girl died because of you. Tell me what was so bullshit about my Language. defense then. Come on, say it. Everything! That's enough, Izumita. It's okay, Izumira-san. There he is, face. Uh, thanks for thinking of me, Yagami-kun. Farewell. Man, has that guy got an aura or what? If I was a chick, I'd be way into that. Not now, Kaito-san. My bad, my bad. So, what do we do about the case? Mafuyu said they're already pressing charges. We should go to Genda's. <coughs> Let Shintani know what's going Sorry. on. Sorry, should have muted that. Too. Got it. I'll do better. I'll see you over there then. What is it now? Look, just uh, take a breather, huh? Count to ten or something. I'll give you a breather. Ba -ba -ba. Ah. Oh, hey. It's that one. Sorry to bug you, but I need to ask a small favor. Just thinking of it, or just think of it paying me back. Oh my god. Just think of it as paying me back for the last time. Fair enough. What do you need me to do? Buy me a model figure. There's a specific one I've been looking for, and apparently they have it at Abisu. Which makes sense since they're limited edition and sold out everywhere. This may be my only chance to get it. All right, I'll see what I can do. But be so. He must mean the pawn shop. That's not too far. Sakumo's always helping me out, so I do owe him one. Poor guy's never felt comfortable outdoors. All right, we got our first friend event. Let's uh, pause this for one second. All right. All right. Uh, this episode is probably going to be a little more uh, heavily edited than what we normally do. Or maybe that for the next little while. Um, because of the cold and that kind of stuff, I make gross noises. So, usually I don't like editing because I think the stuff that happens in between things is sometimes funny. And also I don't know what I'm doing. So, Love Star Figure, Bronze Plate, Bishop Rook. Abisu. He has some sturdy plastic. I don't know what any of that means. Let's get the figure. No, not two. There we go. Alright, so we got us figured. Is that the wrong dang figure? Oh no. I think I bought the wrong figure. Oh. Crap. Well, that was stupid. Let's sell that figure back. Actually. 
Let's sell some. Uh, I don't think I need a plate. I'm losing money on that. All right, whatever. Oh, I do keep a bed on that one. Cannot carry because of, no, I'm trying to buy. So the having to hit a different button to complete purchase is kind of I don't know. I don't like that particular gameplay thing. Excuse me. Excuse me. All right. Excuse me. Guy looks like he's in the Japanese partridge family. We just got in a fight. What if we bought some food? Oh, I want a beef bowl. What do you mean I can't eat anymore? All right, well, we'll just eat a beef bowl with nothing to drink. Makes sense. Ah, it's the spot. Yeah. Back to it. Yeah, man. Good for you. Still hate the name Wet Kitchen. <laughs> name that literally anything else and I'd be like alright so I gotta go all the way down to the end excuse me I don't even touch you there was room lady probably help if I paid attention to the mini map the that noise was. Hey. Brought you the goods. It's this one, right? Yep, that's the one. Many thanks. How much was it? Nah, it's on me. I'm paying you back for last time, remember? Really? Hey, that's pretty generous of you. No worries. Though, wouldn't it have been quicker to go yourself? What can I say? I'm a busy guy. Plus, there's this pre-order about to open up, so it's time to man the battle stations. You always got a reason to stay cooped up, huh? You never change. Nah, I shouldn't say that. You've improved a lot, actually. It's all thanks to you. I might never have made human contact again if it weren't for you reaching out to me. Yeah. Yeah. Speaking of which, <laughs> you finally set foot out of your house, only to end up hiding away in a net cafe? <laughs> well, the rent's cheap, and the internet's fast. What more could you want in life? Besides, that's the perfect place for an informant to set up base of operations. True. You always have been a big help, that's for sure. Either way, I'm lucky to have you. <laughs> right back at you. All right. Once you become friends with someone, you'll receive items from them when they pay when you pay them a visit. If you don't get an item, try coming back later. Alright, so 
Frames are important for side cases, all of that. Gonna do karaoke while I'm in here. Hey, there's a shower booth. Well. That did say karaoke, didn't it? Maybe it's on a different level. That's right there. I can't do it. All right. Well, let's uh, you know what? let's go into Club Sega for just a second. Let's take a look in here because this has also been one of my favorite parts of this. What is that? Morrow of the Dead. 500 yen per play. Wow. Should I, though? Let's see the rules. It's a rail shooter sent an uh, alternate version of Kamarocho, one where zombified citizens roam the streets. Uh, let's see. Uh, wise grenade. How do I actually shoot, though? Yeah, let's give it a shot. I said to take a break, so. Alright, shoot is B, reload. Bomb. Alright. Let's do chapter one. It was not long before the virus completely overwhelmed Kamarucho. In order to end this disaster, the government called for an aerial saturation bombing to end the undead outbreak and exterminate the virus once and for all. However, there were still some survivors left in Camarocho. But only a few scan hours remain until the bombing commences. That's a pretty good setup. Will you make it out of Camarocho alive or die along with it? Let's find out. Controls are a little finicky. Alright. This would be way better with a light gun. But, that's not too bad. Alright. Oh, look at that guy. He goes, oh lord. Stay back. Let me alone. Let me alone. Let me alone. I thought I shot you in the head. Oh, that's pretty good. Uh-oh. Licky. Hey, we did it. Look at that. S rank, baby. That's what I'm talking about. Going to chapter two. Okay, big boy. Uh oh. I'm gonna be honest with you. I feel like the zombies are this easy to take out. Maybe bombing the place is a bit extreme. Because, oh, oh, hey, leave me alone. Those of you that have watched me play games long enough, 
No, I'm not good. Oh, God. Quit it. Ah. Oh. There we go. Oh, hey. Hey. Quit it. Stop. Quit it. Hey. Stop. Oh. Oh, no. There we go. Oh, another... Oh, this guy's got a hairy bag. Alright. Take that, sir. Got a B rank on that one. That's still pretty good. I'll take it. Chapter 3. this guy. Ah, back up, back up. Nope. Ain't you just wiggly. It's gotta be real inconvenient to eat. I have very loose determination of what a hit is here. I forgot about grenades. That's pretty good. Ah. Stop. Ah, oh, yes. This shouldn't have been the ever so. ever so dangerous foot. Stop. Oh. Oh, 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 come on, come on, come on. Oh, that didn't work. What is that?
flat line. Alright, well. There we go. I'm dead. We are going to wrap this up here. If you like what you saw, give us a like, consider subscribing. Again, my name is Corey. I'm the old man that's bad at games. We'll see you next time.